Kia good day, and welcome to the history of Aotearoa New Zealand, episode 0. What is this? Hello there. If you've managed to find this, download it, and bother to turn it on to listen to it, then it's probably safe to assume two things. One, that you're a fan of history, and two, you want to know more about the history of New Zealand. Great, that's what this podcast is about, if you hadn't gathered that from the title already. I intend in this episode to give you an idea of what this is going to entail, and hopefully sell you on the idea of the project so you'll want to keep listening and hopefully learning. The idea of this podcast started when I began listening to other narrative history podcasts to satiate my thirst for knowledge and learning about the world. However, when I finally decided to find something similar for my own home country to those of the History of Rome, the History of Byzantium, or the British History podcast, I came up with nothing. I felt a bit despondent about this and let it mull over in my brain for a while, umming and ahhing over whether I should give it a go and whether I should even do something on the scale of those really brilliant podcasts. It wasn't until I saw the Gallipoli exhibit and the Great War exhibition in Wellington that I really decided to give it a crack. The stories of the men and women involved in this country's biggest military disaster was naturally shocking and very sobering. I wanted to be able to tell the stories of these people and let the wider world know who they were and what they fought for, as well as those who came before them. Another reason I wanted to start this project was that I personally believe that the teaching of the history of New Zealand that isn't the Treaty of Waitangi is severely lacking, and as such, I think an easily accessible resource like this could be a great benefit to history nerds as well as the wider public. This podcast will be a narrative history in the vein of those podcasts already mentioned. That is to say that it will be like me telling you a story with characters, events, twists and turns, while also hopefully teaching you something new. If you are listening to this close to the time of the upload, then the first few proper episodes are already up for your enjoyment. They cover the land before humans and how the early Māori arrived here. The hope would be to take it all the way up into the 20th century if this project is deemed worthy enough by those of you out there. I'm also looking at doing uh, dramatic retellings of Māori myths such as Kupe, Maui, and those that describe how the mountains, rivers, and lakes came to be, and why certain birds only sing at certain times or look at the way that they do. Māori myth is filled with colourful characters and stories which I think would be really cool to add some storytelling flair to. I'll potentially be doing special type episodes on Māori art, language, medicine, food, warfare, etc. That last one, of course, including something most people in the world who follow sport would be familiar with, the haka. Other topics I'd like to cover are the voyages of various Europeans to New Zealand, early settler and Māori relations, the land wars, of course the treaty itself, and Aotearoa's involvement in the world wars. Not to spoil too much, but I absolutely cannot wait to cover the Bob Semple with you, arguably the most amazing thing this country has ever produced. Of course, you're probably wondering who this voice is you are hearing, and hopefully going to be hearing more of. Uh, My name is Thomas, I'm a Kiwi born and bred, having lived in Aotearoa all my life. Although my background is not history related, it's actually working with native animals, I am a mega history nerd. I'm a sponge for all interesting facts about animals, history, and science in general, really. I have a great passion for learning and sharing knowledge, a passion that I hope to convey and perhaps pass on to you, dear listener. At the moment, this is currently a passion project for me, something I will be doing in my spare time. As such, I do work a full-time job, and I am pretty new to this, so I don't currently have any schedule on account of I don't know how long episodes will take to produce. In saying that, I will try to get episodes out once every two, three weeks, or earlier if I can. I'm only a one-man show, uh, and your patience will be highly appreciated and hopefully worth the wait. You can probably also tell uh, that I am pretty much reading off a script, um, so I do apologise if that very easily does come through. I will try to become better at recording, speaking, editing, and not sounding like I'm reading from a Word doc, which, as I said, is exactly what I'm doing. So again, your patience with this would be amazing. Uh, Now, no doubt, it will be of liberal importance to most of you, but I think I should probably disclose the following. I am Pākehā. My ancestry does entirely come from Britain. I say I should disclose this as I am sure there are those of you out there, uh, hopefully a small minority, uh, that won't like me talking about Māori history just by the fact I have no ancestry or link to any iwi. Personally, I don't think this is a concern. Uh, The history of this land and its people is a history that belongs to all of us, not just any one group due to ancestral links. We are all New Zealanders, we are all Kiwis, and it is a history of the people that were here before that have made this country what it is today. 
To add to this, this podcast will endeavour to show history in the most unbiased light as possible. This will mean showing its sometimes brutal and unsavoury side that we may wish to ignore. These ideas, events or people have shaped our country just as much as any triumph and as such should not be glossed over. In saying that, we aren't going to be all serious all the time. Uh, history should be fun and exciting, and hopefully it will be. I will endeavour uh, to educate as well as entertain. To add to all that, this podcast is not meant to be a comprehensive source. I will endeavour to do my best in covering as much as possible, but naturally some stuff will need to be cut. Further reading is always encouraged and I would consider a success uh, if I inspired you to go out and seek more information on your own. Overall, the main ethos of this podcast, I think, can be summed up in the popular Māori saying, E aha te mea nui o te ao. He tangata, he tangata, he tangata. What is the most important thing in the world? It is people, it is people, it is people. If you aren't a native Kiwi, that is, someone from New Zealand, then some of the words I've used so far may be foreign to you. In fact, the first thing I said to you likely would have confused you. Kia ora is a casual greeting in te reo Māori, Māori language, which will naturally feature heavily in this podcast. Uh, as a non-fluent speaker of te reo myself, I'm not expecting anyone to know each and every word used. I will assume in this podcast that everyone is coming at it fresh. You know nothing of New Zealand and you just want to know more, so I will endeavour to explain each idea and word as we go so we don't get lost. To add to this, since I am not a fluent speaker, I am eventually going to mispronounce something along the way. In fact, I probably already have, uh, so if I have done, uh, I do apologise greatly for that. So when that happens, feel free to send me an angry email telling me I stuffed up so I can correct it. I also encourage you to do this if I get a fact, a date, or basically anything else wrong. Uh, we do need to get this right, I think that's very, very important, and the help of those that know more uh, does help me greatly, uh, and is much, much appreciated. So to wrap this up, this will be a narrative show about the history of New Zealand, from prehistory to the nearly modern day, and I will endeavour to do my best in pronunciation and getting in any information right. Uh, but this can, and let's be honest, likely will go wrong, so I do hope uh, that you can point that out to me uh, and forgive me for any minor errors. Most importantly, I am here to help educate and entertain you. Uh, I really think this can be something useful and special to New Zealand and the wider historical podcast community, and I hope that you think so too, and will join me for this trip through the fantastic history of our island nation. If you have any questions that I haven't covered here, or you want to suggest topics or directions for the show to go in, you can email me at historyaltaroa at gmail.com, or you can find me on Twitter at History Aotearoa, or even Facebook at History of Aotearoa New Zealand Podcast. Aotearoa, of course, spelled A-O-T-E-A-R-O-A. And with that, I say, Haritu atu, hokitu mai. Go well, and return in good health.